I am back with my goodies cookies. They just came out of the oven. The instructions are to bake them at 350 for nine to 11 minutes. Uh, check as soon as the edges get brown. Mine took 11 minutes on the dot and it made 13 cookies and I let them cool. I took them out of the oven exactly four minutes ago and I took the baking sheet out from under them so they'd cool quicker, but I made 13 delicious cookies and now that they're cool, uh, cooled off, uh, they scoop up great. The hardest part about these cookies is letting them cool off and waiting before you eat them. They are chewy, they are delicious. Again, mine made 13 of them. Hold on, I'm gonna put them on a really pretty plate and show you. I would eat one for you, but I've had them before and I can tell you right now, great consistency, chewy, perfect amount of sweetness. It feels like you're eating a chocolate chip cookie on a ketogenic diet. I can't thank Deanna enough for making these. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I don't know what I would do without them. And the second hardest part about these cookies is not eating all 13 of them. Now it says it makes about 12 large cookies. I showed you, I used that scooper and again, it made 13. Maybe she gave me a little extra. I don't know Deanna. I just have heard about her through the ketogenic world. And ba -dum, ba -dum, these are the finished product. Can't tell you how much I love these cookies. Oh, they're still a little bit falling apart. I did not let them cool long enough. So this one has been on the plate longest, yeah. Mm, yeah, make these, buy these. I wish I made a commission on them, I do not. They are really, really, really good. Thanks again to Deanna coming up with goodies. You can get them on Amazon. Maybe I'll post a link uh, below so that you can just press on it and it'll take you right to Amazon. And the blondies are also superb. I think she's coming out with a lot more too. So stay tuned. Love them. Bye. Hi, Debbie from Fat Fueled at 50. I'm going to show you my favorite dessert uh, for your ketogenic diet. These um, goodies you can get on Amazon and they're about $12 each. They make the most delicious chocolate chip cookies and super easy to uh, put together. So I thought maybe I would demonstrate how I bake these. Uh, these are by far my most favorite ketogenic dessert and I love having them already baked and in a Ziploc bag for snacking. So here we go. You open the bag, put it in a mixing bowl. You only need three ingredients, four including the package of goodies chocolate chip cookie bake mix. I do want to show you too, they also have uh, blondies. These are really, really good as well. I'm just doing the chocolate chip cookies, super easy. Mix, quarter cup of melted coconut oil, one egg and a teaspoon of vanilla. That's it. I like a little extra vanilla. You can also add to this mix nuts if you so, so choose. I just think they're so perfect the way they are. And mix, mix, mix. And I'll get back on here and show you how easy they drop on the pan. Well, I guess I'll just keep going because that's how fast it is. This is not boring at all because before you know it, we're gonna have chocolate chip cookies. They bake at a 350 degree oven. I have my oven already preheated. That's it. I mean, oh, you could smell the coconut oil. I could eat this with a spoon. I've tried it, it's delicious. Not even kidding you. On the instruction, she says after they bake to let them cool before you try to eat them. I agree with that. They fall apart, but once they cool off, oh man, they are really, really good. Okay, so that's the mix. Very, very easy to work with. The woman who came up with this, I think her name is Deanna. She lives in New York City and she's a baker. She came up with it. She did all the hard work for us, guys. Thank you, Deanna. Hold on, I'm gonna get my... Okay, 
handy dandy scooper. Can you see this? I am going to just pop them on my baking sheet. All right, I'll be back to show you the rest. I'm so excited.